With these I feel much more complete, but it is bad. Summon your fortune tellers, summon all your psychics, and ask your oracles and spirits, who am I? And you shall find something sinister. Greetings, everyone. I'm sorry for a later transmission. Today I would like to continue my talk on what is best in life. Of course, everyone has their own ideas on what is best in life, because everyone has their own taste and individual liking. Since we are talking about the spirituality, religion and the force, let us talk about the dark side of the force. What is best in life according to the dark side of the force? From my uh, previous transmissions, you know that uh, Buddhism likes to claim itself being the most uh, brightest side of the force, and other religions, especially shamanism, is the dark side of the force. So, uh, what is best in life to have? There is uh, three, yes, maybe more. Uh, religious terms uh, that you must have in the dark side of the force to feel more complete. Number one is the horse power. Of course, it's always good to have a horse power, and we call the horse power as he murdered or this uh, invisible spirit or the gas horse. You must know that uh, the dark side of the force was created by the horse riding culture. So um, the horse became the symbol of good luck, uh, faith and religion. In general, people think that this uh, spirit horse or this horse power simply means a good luck. But from my previous transmissions, you know that uh, horse is more than a good luck. It is your faith and religion. So uh, one can say that uh, a man with a faith and religion is lucky one. It uh, sounds a little bit funny. Or it's uh, someone with a strength. It is like, uh, with the help of God and gods, I feel much stronger. So, number two. Number two is idea of portent. Here, we need to have a portent. So, um, uh, we call it as Hofte. Uh, being Hofte is believed to be good. So, uh, what is this percent? We all know that percent is a, a part of a something. I mean, uh, this symbol looks like a Chinese yin yang, and a yin is a part of a or percent of this uh, whole uh, symbol. So, what is uh, why it is best to be uh, this part or this incomplete uh, part of a something? Well, it is got a little bit hard to explain, but let, it, let me explain it on uh, uh, life. Uh, let me explain it on um, a family. Um, it is always good to be a part of a family. Uh, being brother, being father, and uh, sister, mother, and etc., etc. Also, it is always good to have children. So, um, you must know that uh, the half uh, portent of your genes or blood uh, 
uh, or your force is uh, in your children. So, um, a man with a man and of course a woman with their children is called Hote Hung, meaning uh, they have percent, but uh, simply means they are um, they are lucky. They are having some kind of a percent. Also, um, people uh, like to talk about the freedom. We are talking about what is best in life. And if you ask, uh, you know, this uh, common people, they will always answer you that uh, freedom is the best in life. But freedom without privacy is hell. So you need a privacy. So you need to have own share of privacy. And um, privacy is uh, respect. Uh, it's a part of uh, respecting individual rights. So uh, an individual person is ca called percent human or hol hung hol hung means an individual and um, individual rights or this privacy is called hol uh, huni ir so um, this idea that uh, individuality is very important is in, is in our dark side of the force or it's a part of our religion Number three, mm, everyone uh, likes to say that Otomta uh, and Sodorta is good. Word Otomta uh, means to have a good origin or to have a family. So uh, if you are following this bright side of the force, you will never have this Otom meaning uh, family bloodline. And of course, the uh, word uh, Sodor is going to be this uh, Sanskrit word for a book. So uh, having a book and having like a family is good. Well, um, I find it, uh, maybe it's an uh, influence from a, you know, this alien world, so to speak. Well, uh, now you know what is best in life according to the dark side of the force. Well, uh, that's pretty much for today, and thanks for watching my transmission.